Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. What a wonderful So today's video is going to be my updated body care inventory slash collection for 2023. So I believe the last time I did this was like after summer SAS. So I wanted to do one again after winter SAS. Um, I'll put up a link my last one up above so you can see that but I will be comparing numbers before and after um, just so you guys can see that but I have everything laid on my bed and I think I did some damage during the holidays so I have a lot of body care so I expect that my total is probably going to be a lot different than what it was last time I checked in with you guys so that's okay I usually end up buying more in the fall and winter anyways but yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys what I have laid out here and let's go through everything. All right, so here's my bed and everything laid out on it. It's a lot. So the bottom row right here, shower gel and then body lotion, body cream, um, scrubs, some minis and perfume, and then all of my sprays. So let's start off with the shower gels down at the bottom. So right here I have two beach nights and I just picked up one at Winter SAS. Whip Vanilla Chiffon, One Midnight Amber Glow, uh, Champagne Apple and Honey, Pumpkin Pecan Waffles, Vanilla Mocha Cream, Life of the Party, Winterberry Wonder, which I'm currently using, Iced Sugar Plum, and Wrapped in Vanilla. Wrapped in Vanilla is my, like my new favorite. And then I have three moisturizing body washes, Sunshine Mimosa, Midnight Amber Glow, and In the Stars. And then one random brand body wash from OGX and Coconut Coffee. And then going through my lotions, I tried to kind of match them up, not really, um, but I do have a Beach Nights, Strawberry Pound Cake, Champagne Apple and Honey, White Pumpkin and Chai, Pumpkin Cupcake, Midnight Amber Glow, Vanilla Mocha Cream, Iced Sugar Plum, Christmas Cookies, which I'm using right now, Twisted Peppermint and Winterberry Wonder, which I'm also using right now. And then I only have four body creams, so I'm doing really good in this collection. Um, Enchanted Candy Potion, which I'm actually going to save for like springtime. Vanilla Mocha Cream Wrapped in Vanilla, which I'm using right now. You can tell I've got some progress on it. And a Midnight Amber Glow. So moving on to body scrubs. I've got nine body scrubs right now. Starting with the tubes. I have one from Dionys in the Goat Milk Whip Body Scrub. This one's like really um, gentle on the skin. It's in the scent Vanilla Bean. I've got three from Bath and Body Works. I have the Pure Wonder Exfoliating Glow Body Scrub. It's really gorgeous packaging on this one. I have one Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte in the Foaming Sugar Scrub. And then one Midnight Amber Glow in the Creamy Body Scrub. I really love this formula. I've got one from Trader Joe's in the Brazil Nut Body Scrub. I actually don't know if I ever opened this. Yeah, it's completely sealed, but I bought this like near the end of the summer last year, so I'm excited to break it out and start using it this summer. I've got one from Onyx Bathhouse in the Hot Mess Express scent and this is I believe honey pomegranate. Yeah pomegranate plus musk plus honey so honey pomegranate. I've got one from the Creme Shop X Hello Kitty in Caramel Pumpkin Latte. I'm using this one right now and I'm also using this one from Scentsy in Appleberry. I'm almost done with it. And then this one from Tree Hut and Velvet Coffee. I've got two body butters. I've got the Brazil Nut Body Butter, again, from Trader Joe's. I use this quite a bit. I'm trying to show you guys how much I have last year. So this is a really awesome scent. And it really does smell very similar to Sol de Janeiro. And then the Midnight Amber Glow Glotion Body Butter. I actually just picked this up, um, I think, at Body Care Day. So I haven't really used it that much, but I love that scent. And then a one random Jergens Wet Skin Medium to Deep Natural Glow Moisturizer. I start to use this when summer comes around, so I'll be using that probably soon, actually. And then I have 23 mists. So I have it organized, again, by season. So up top right here, these are like the non-seasonal ones, just like all year round. Velvet Sugar, Almond Blossom, Warm Vanilla Sugar, and Twinkling Nights. And then we've got some spring whipped vanilla chiffon and champagne toast and then summer beach nights and mint chocolate swirl along with a sol de janeiro brazilian crush 71 this one is one of my absolute favorites and then two from pink in vanilla swirl and whipped dream these are actually christmasy scents i just couldn't fit them down below 
We got some fall scents from Bath & Body Works in White Pumpkin and Chai, Vanilla Mocha Cafe, Bonfire Bash, and then Winter Frosted Wonderland. This one is actually like my archive collection. I barely use this one because I never want to get rid of it. It's from 2014 and it's one of my absolute favorites. Um, I actually repurchased this one on... Um, Ooh, let me not lay it down because it looks like it's leaking a little bit, but I repurchased this one on Mercari and it's just one of my favorites. I'll never finish this. Moving on, we have Vanilla Bean Noel, Coconut Mint Drop, one of my all-time favorites too, Christmas Cookies, Iced Sugar Plum, Blush Cardigan, and Wrapped in Vanilla. And then we do have two Shimmer Mists, one in Twilight Woods and one in Happy Halloween Vampire Blood. Okay, on this section, I have all of my minis and my perfumes. So I guess let's start with minis. So I have two mini body creams, one in Open Sky and one in Champagne Apple and Honey. I've got four mini sprays, one Champagne Apple and Honey, one Midnight Amber Glow, warm vanilla sugar, and then a Victoria's Secret Bear, which I actually really want to put in my next Project Use It Up and see if I like it because I really haven't used it that much. I've got three mini shower gels, one in just the Olay Triple Moisture, uh, Pure Wonder, and an Into the Night. I've got seven pocket backs right here. I've got two in Toasted Vanilla and Chives. This is one of my favorite scents. One Frozen Lake, Winter Candy Apple, Sunshine and Lemons, Raspberry Jam, and Mahogany Coconut. And then for my um, hand lotions, I have an In the Stars, a Strawberry Pound Cake, and a Vanilla Bean Noel. And then this random one from Burt's Bees, which is a uh, almond and milk hand cream. It's in a little pot, so I find this hard to use. Um, but I think I, if I put it in one of my purses, I could probably finish it, but... That's those, and then moving on to perfumes. I have a lot of these little roller balls because I don't use perfume enough to justify having a lot of big bottles, and that's something I need to get better at this year, but I have one from Mary Kay and Winter Wishes that I'm trying to finish up. This is from like 2014 or something. I have a Sunshine Mimosa, Into the Night, and two Midnight Amber Glows because I'm obsessed with this scent. I have this little set from um, Ariana Grande, I believe this is Moonlight, this is Ari, and then these two are both Sweet Light Candy. And then I have a KLE Vanilla 28. I could finish this up probably in like a week if I wanted to. I love this scent so much, but I'm kind of savoring it. <laughs> and then I have these three minis. So this is a Tom Ford Ebony Perfume, which I think I'm actually going to give to Ryan because it smells really masculine and I don't know if I like it. And then I have a Mix Bar Glass Rose and another mix bar in Coconut Palm. I'm just saving this one for the um, summertime. And then these three right here, I have a Floriental Brown Sugar from Dossier, a Musky Musk from Dossier, and a Champagne Toast. This one is my baby. I just picked her up at, um, I think it was Cyber Monday when the whole store was like 50% off. Such a good deal. I'm so happy to have my first like full-size Bath & Body Works perfume and yeah, I'm really excited to use that one. So that's actually all of my body care. Uh, that actually went really fast. I'm kind of surprised. I kind of went quick through it. So let me know if you guys want to know my thoughts on any of the stuff that I have. Um, but yeah, that's my numbers. I'm definitely, um, I have a lot more stuff than I want. Um, I'd love to reduce my like lotions and shower gels by half, probably by the summertime. That would be really great to me. I think I can definitely do it. Um, I think I went overboard this past year on stocking up for things for next year. So that's my bad. Um, but I definitely am still working on things and I'm finishing up stuff pretty quickly. Like I'll have this Christmas cookies um, body lotion finished up in the next couple of weeks. So it's just a matter of me trying to finish off stuff. But yeah, that's my collection right now. Um, I'm totally fine with like how my um, shower gels, I mean, how my body creams are doing. I'm good with my minis. Like that's totally fine. And I'm actually kind of okay with the size of my um, body scrubs because I've actually been really enjoying trying out new body scrubs and new formulas. So I'm totally fine with like the size of my body scrub collection and I'm using them every single day. So I feel really good about my body scrub collection, even though it's a little bigger than it was last year. Just really my shower gels and my lotions I need to focus on. And if I could finish a mist, that would be great. But you guys know I use those up super slowly. So I just have to be careful about how many new ones I bring in. So yeah, that's everything for the overview of my body care collection as of January 2023. And yes, I almost just said 2022. It does not feel like 2023 is real, you guys. 
feels really weird. But yeah, that is everything for this video. Let me know down below, how are you feeling about your collection as of right now? I know most of us probably overbought for SAS. It's just such a good deal on all the body care that, I mean, like, I'm, I'm just... I'm a sucker what can I say but yeah I'm definitely gonna be focusing on my body care in the next couple of months and usually what I end up doing like just the way that I cycle through my body care is I end up not really buying in the spring and summer and focusing on using up stuff and then buying new stuff in the fall and winter which is my favorite season and kind of just using as I go for those so anyways that is everything for this video I hope you guys enjoyed if you did like comment and subscribe down below and I will see you all in my next one Bye.